Samantha here. Welcome back to another episode of Sims 4 Get to Work. And we are back with Harrison's family. And today is the day one of their romantic vacation getaway to Selva Dorado. Or is it Selva Dorada? I don't even remember. But anyway, uh, we're getting ready now to get out here in just a second. Um, so I got her going to queue up and do some laundry. So let's go and add that to the washing machine. We can go and get that started. And then we're going to dry the load that she already had in here. Because, you know, y'all know how it is when you're about to go on vacation and you got kids and you got housework and chores and all sorts of stuff. You're like, let me get all this stuff together so that we can get out of here successfully. Uh, Colin, dude, why aren't you going to school? No. Okay. Wow. Why isn't he, go he in here watching yeah. TV? He was like, I'm not going to school today. Dude, go to school. You got your nerves. Anyway, so he got school today. Um, and of course, Catherine's parents are here. Kind of, kind of helping out. Uh, I'm going to watch the kids while we're gone and everything. So grandma's over here making breakfast, even though she's not really good at it. She's a little bit out of season. Let's put it that way. Um, so anyway, so they'll be home today. And I see Elsie's coming down the stairs. Uh, Harrison, though, I had you queued up to go clean up the bath okay he did it all right so we're cleaning up the bathroom we're getting some stuff done so grandma's making breakfast for us and then after that we can go on and get our vacation started so a want to apologize it is i know i know it's love day i didn't mean to do that but a i would like to apologize because um it's been a while since you guys have seen one of these episodes and um i just I had to take a quick little break and i'm trying to explain in all my lps but i will make a full video you know regarding what happened because i was struggling with it for a little bit like should i say something and then i was like i think i probably should because you never know what you can say that can kind of like help somebody else oh harrison when you finish with this we can't leave the house clean out spoiled food and let's go on and repair this can we repair it um because we definitely well we could reply ah. Do we want to replace it? You know what, y'all? Can we? Okay, repair. I'm going to say, can we repair it? I don't even know if we can. All right, baby girl, are you going to grab something to eat? Oh, I thought she was downstairs. I thought she was just downstairs. What are you doing, Elsie? Anyway, um, but you never know. Sometimes you can make, you know, you can make, you can reveal some truths about yourself. And in the long run, you can end up helping someone else with their journey. So I said, maybe it'll be a good idea to talk about it. And just, um... You know, just, just so y'all could see kind of like, I guess, what was kind of going on. I don't know. We'll, we'll see how it goes. But either way, oh, she's like, Daddy, thank you so much for coming to watch the kids. Um, but anyway, so long story short, that is pretty much. Um, yep, we got all your stuff, Dad. Thank you. And I appreciate Mom, you making breakfast and everything. And Mom's over here cleaning up. I love that. All right, Harrison. Oh, I like that they have such a good relationship. They really do. Even though, if you guys know, the backstory of her parents is they do a lot of traveling. Uh, Colin is the class all-star today and he gets to be interviewed by his entire class he's feeling nervous Colin is Harrison and Catherine's kid he's gonna be witty um all right Colin tries to make a joke out of it something about alphabets and there's nothing but the a but when every kid stares stays silent he opts for silence too oh all right oh whoa mom's repairing it mom you didn't have to repair that Okay, Harrison. All right, it's okay. Mom, mom wants to repair it. All right, baby girl, did you eat before we go? Okay, she's actually good. She just needs some attention. So you know what? If mom wants to repair that, she's really trying to help out as much as she can. Y'all, she already repaired it that quick? Well, excuse me. Um, all right, well, Elsie's going back upstairs. So I guess she's good to go. But we need to get going because, like, the resort check-in time is... Uh, oh, why do they keep resetting like that? Are you going to throw that away, mom? Are you throwing it away? Okay, thank you. Anyway, the resort check-in time is like two or three or something like that. So we probably should go on and get headed. We got quite the journey ahead of us. So I'm actually going to go on and get him toggled up to go downstairs and arrange for our travel plans. So let's go on and do, it feels like forever since I go on vacation. There's a social event working right now. What social event? It's almost Evelyn's time. What are you talking about? She's supposed to be here watching the kids. What are y'all talking about? Okay, so why can't I go? What social event is going? If it's this holiday, y'all, we go. We can cancel that out. I'm not even worried about that. Um. All right. Why can't I take a vacation? Oh, okay. Really, Catherine? I'm trying to book us so we can get out of here, homegirl. Um. Thank you for getting up. Household, go on vacation. 
Oh, while working, Selfish. we took a vacation day. Uh-uh, in -uh, that. Is that the reason? Um, household. Wow, that was the reason? Because it's... Wait a minute. Because it was TV season premiere day? Y'all tripping. Anyway, let's go on and head to Selva Dorado. Alright guys, this vacation is starting out absolutely wonderful. First of all, they are totally upset that TV season premiere was horrible, but why in the world is the season's calendar events affecting us going on vacation? Why is that considered a social event that we can't leave town for? I could care less about that's what people got DVR and stuff for. Anyway, we are currently <laughs> in Selva Dorado or Selva Dorada. What is it? I don't even remember. Either way, we're in Jungle Adventures land because I know somebody's going to come in the comments like, you said it wrong. I probably did. I forget what it's called. But anyway, um, this particular lot, I actually created it. It's in the gallery if you guys want to go on and grab it. I did a... Um, a speed build on it too when jungle adventures came out so if you guys want to go on and grab it and the funny thing is i did it for um hopes of uh <laughs> from, an, from another couple from another lp to do their honeymoon here but they haven't been on their honeymoon yet so i was like well, we'll use it for um harrison and Catherine here so let's just go on and get inside and um can we just go here together kind of sucks that it's raining though because i was really hoping that we can partake of um some of the activities that the jungle provides is it going to be raining the entire time so rain today sunny tomorrow perfect and then we actually leave saturday so that's actually really good okay so we just got a little bit of rain today so maybe we'll just do some activities indoors today we could always go to the bar um go meet some of the locals go learn how to do the dance and stuff like that but here is the lot just in case you guys hadn't seen that speed build it was considerable a considerable amount of time ago but anyway and here in this little foyer, you got like this little archaeological table that you can work on some of the finds and stuff. And it's just in this little main area. And then you go in through here and it's like the uh, living quarters. There's like a little kitchen so they can kind of cook and experiment with some of the local cuisine. There's a table, and like some decorations and everything. A ton of open windows, y'all. Everything is just like completely open here. Well, I guess except for that window. Then there's like a TV, a speaker. They can sit in here and watch movies. And then they got the bedroom in here. Um, well, well <laughs> the only bedroom in here. And then there's a bathroom and it's really cute because there's like a little toilet in here so they can use the restroom in privacy and of course there's like a huge sink there's toiletries and there's a shower and a tub i wish that they could take a tub a bath i was about to say take a tub together take a bath together and then of course there's like an outdoor fireplace they can sit out here and grill and kind of just like hang out and it's up on stilts so it's kind of like there's jungle foliage 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 <laughs> underneath here so um you know it, it feels like it's like up high and it, what I wanted to mimic was like you know the jungle is such a beautiful place that they didn't want to disturb the um the the the, the trees and stuff so it's kind of like something that was built around a lot of existing foliage so um that's the reason why it's kind of like going along with the land as opposed to like um what am I trying to say? As opposed to being like tearing down the land, if that makes any sense. Anyway, let's go ahead and get in here. Let's see if we can go ahead and get pop in. I'm going to let Catherine get changed and also let uh, Harrison get changed so they can be ready for the jungle adventure. Let's see, because it's currently, I mean, it's warm, but it's a heavy rain. Is it going to rain all day, y'all? You know what? I wish that we could check. I swear, I feel like every time I play this, I come up with ideas for them to like add like little tweaks to the game. But it's like you get, we have different weathers in different areas. So it'd be nice if we had a way to actually check for the weather in different areas. Because had I known it was going to rain all day, maybe we would have came tomorrow because love day is tomorrow. So technically we could have came tomorrow and you know, but it's like we took a vacation day for it and nothing. But anyway, I'm gonna let them go get changed and I'll be right back. All right, guys, they're all changed up. So Harrison's just going to make some popcorn. We're just going to chill out for a little bit, like watch a movie, do a little bit of, I guess, Netflix and chilling in the jungle. But since we can't go out and actually explore, it's a little bit disappointing. But he's going to pop them some popcorn and stuff. Uh, and then we're going to see. He's already thinking about what movie he's going to watch. And Catherine is in here just getting herself ready. Okay. Are you taking some selfies? What's going on? I came in here. She was taking selfies. Anyway, she's getting herself ready so she can go hang out with her husband. It has been a super, like, that's a pose I got in my game, y'all. But anyway, it's been a super long time since they've had the opportunity. Harrison, did you start the movie without us? Okay, watch action. Okay, hopefully he just is, 
I don't know what he's doing. But anyway, let's come over here and um, grab a serving and have her come grab a serving as well. And then we'll come and watch the movie together. So let's see. I want to say, let's see, watch a movie with... Um, we got Simder, Roy Weisman, da, 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 watch Dom is up for Sims. Man, sometimes I wish they would give us some more. Um... You know what? Let's watch Adventures of Spaceship Simulation. Why not? It might be like a NASA type movie. I don't know. But oh, can y'all go sit in front of the, inside the, in front of the TV and watch your movie with the popcorn? Perfect. Can you sit down though, Catherine? Like I want to. I want to sit with you, darling. Come sit. Come sit down. Okay, why can't she? Okay, she's coming. I'm about to say, girl, what is she doing? Anyway, so they can sit here and watch the movie together and kind of hang out and just enjoy their time together. What I was trying to say before I got interrupted, ooh, the popcorn must be delicious, um, is that it's been a while since so they've had an opportunity to kind of like be by themselves. And, you know, one of my main concerns with their union in general was that it always seemed like Hunter was kind of like an interference with them being you know being together because Harrison was always so worried about him and being that the whole situation with Hunter is kind of like put to bed so to speak we felt like it'd be important for them to just like hang out with each other and just kind of reconnect thankfully it didn't affect their relationship too too badly I'm on the wrong people because uh, they're still pretty maxed out in the green oh why are you telling them to be quiet I hate when they do that that is so rude um but we probably can't even cuddle or anything during the movie because they're sitting here eating the popcorn so which movie is this is something about the spaceship something 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 it's like planet of the aliens planet of the apes planet of the frogs planet of the i have no clue what this is Ooh, they're fighting though wow i've never paid attention to this one before i don't think i've ever watched this one before that's funny are you guys enjoying your time together like what happened whoa are you mad about that? Or he doesn't like the movie. Maybe he's not enjoying the movie right now. <laughs> They're both super flirty right now, though. So that's a good thing. Oh, goodness. He can't laugh now? Come on, y'all. Cut a while watching the movie. And oh, wow. Are you even watching the movie, though? Wow. None of them have made it in their mouth yet. What, in the, what, is, the, <laughs> what is the issue? Can y'all hang out together, though? Can y'all do, like, a little bit of cuddling? Yeah. Oh, what, what was that? Uh, Oh, whoa. Okay, they don't like this movie, y'all. It's super, it's making him super flirty, but it might be the lot, too, y'all, because it's got a nice little drizzle out. You can hear the rain pitter patter through the windows. So I'm sure. I am sure. Oh, well, that was quick. The movie's over already? Okay, that was quick. All right, well, let's sit down with your wife and y'all do a little cuddling or whatever. Look how she's like. Uh -huh. Your mama is definitely not a llama. Not looking like how you looking. Okay, sir. Anyway, let's see if we can get a little. She is in a real flirty mood. Um, Let's see if we can get it popping a little bit. We're going to uh, whisper some sweet nothings. Make out a bit. We're going to kiss. Um, what else can we do? Let's give her a massage. Of course, he wants to woohoo. Who wouldn't want to woohoo? It's raining and you in the jungle and you with your missus. Like, that sounds like a perfect opportunity. Okay, anyway, let's go on and do all this and queue it up. It appears Colin is having problems with the alphabet. He can't. Aw, yay, Colin. I'm glad he's at home. Um, really? Could you have not? We, what was the issue? Wait, what was it that I asked you to do that you couldn't do? crazy all right there we go let's get some pictures y'all because this is really special oh let's get down here and get some pictures um even though I, that's not a very flattering picture right there uh but it is what it is we i just like to have snapping pictures anyway so we can commemorate all these memories that we have is this door oh okay oh that's a doorway i was gonna say is this door oh let me get my couple y'all i love it they're so sweet. I remember when they met, y'all. I swear, I've been playing with this family for so long. Like, I remember when they met. I remember, like, all the little stuff. It's like, you know, it's been, it's been a long time coming. So it's just kind of like, I really do appreciate their union and their whole little ordeal together. I really do. Aww. I'm so glad they got a chance to spend time with each other. I wish there was, like, a maid service with these little, um... Wait, why is this one giving us a fame? Okay, whatever. We're going to go woohoo because, of course, you can't sit there and be enjoying this beautiful ambiance without getting a quick little woohoo session in. But anyway, uh, did we queue it up or are y'all telling me y'all can't? Or y'all can't? Y'all can do that or what? Woohoo with Catherine? Okay. Can we, can we take care of that real quick? 
All right, Mrs. Moore, if you would please join me in the bedroom for a little bit of that thing right there. <laughs> that thing right there but anyway so um, i was about to say something oh it's decorated for love day here oh they decorated it i didn't know they did that in the jungle y'all but i was gonna say we should have made wouldn't that be cool if there was like maid service in the jungle like you got like your little cabana and then people actually come and um and clean it up and stuff for you because wouldn't that be realistic yeah i was not expecting them to decorate this for love day that is adorable that is actually super cute. Oh, anyway, so they're going to sit there <laughs> and do this little whole ordeal for a little bit. And then we're going to try to go. It's already four o'clock. So we'll probably go out into the town square and go buy some supplies and stuff. Because, of course, tomorrow we're going to be able to explore the jungle. It's going to be sunny out. So we'll be able to uh, partake. I really hate that it's raining, but it's like, what else are you going to do? Oh, soulmate. What were we supposed to do? What did we get for that? Perform 50. Okay. Go on three gold dates. All right. Well, you know, we could. Can I ask her on a date while we're here? Let's see. Ask one. Wait, can I or no? How do we do this? Okay. Let me just go to her maybe physically and ask. Why y'all just standing there staring at each other like that? That's creepy. Ask on a date. All right. There we go. I know we're on vacation, but you know, why don't we go out and like go enjoy the fresh air and stuff. Do you want to go get something to drink, something to eat? We just go turn up a little bit in the jungle. All right. She's like, yeah, let's go. All right, guys, here we are in the little town square in the middle of the jungle. So let's go here together. Let's kind of go take advantage of the scenery a little bit. Um, and what did it say? It has happiest of hour for Chief Casey. <laughs> all right. So I guess we'll come in here and let's sit and talk. Well, first of all, let's go get something to drink. Can we order drinks for the group? Order happy hour drink. Let's get a, ooh, a margarita, cha-cha-cha, because we are in the jungle, so why not? Let's go get another margarita. Whoa, oh, I'm like, why are we getting money right now? Okay, she is super flirty right now, but where can we sit and talk? You want to sit here, Catherine? So you can come get something to drink, girlfriend? Sit there. Oh, she has to go use the bathroom. All right, I'll let her get a drink. Let them sit there and talk for a little bit. Um, let's discuss interest a bit and just kind of like have like a nice conversation. As soon as we get our drinks, I'll have her go use the restroom and stuff. But oh, that's the margarita. Cool. Express fondness a bit. All right, and slide this drink on over here before that girl try to take it. All right, Catherine, Catherine, get your drink, darling. Okay. Wait. How, what? How, he took both drinks. What? How you took both drinks? Seriously, dude, who is this? Oh, we gotta go give that to, wow, how about I forgot that? Where is my drink? Y'all, did he take, I swear, I feel like he swiped both of them up. <laughs> what a way to treat your wife, though. Okay, all right, well, no worries. I think, let me see if it's in, maybe it's in her pocket. Okay, we'll just order another one. Um, so hurry up and let's go order happy hour drink. And we're gonna get a margarita. All right, I think he got both, though, y'all. Because I saw him swipe them up. She made, too. All right, there we go. We got somebody doing the Selva Dorado dance or the Selva Doradian. The Selva Doradian dance. All right, so can you... Okay, so she's going to order something to drink. Okay, dang it. I wanted her to talk to him, y'all. That's the only thing about coming over here is they're going to sit far away from each other. How are you going to talk to her, though? How is that supposed to work? Okay, let's see if we could do this here. Maybe we could drink from... Talk from here. Close that up for me, please. Uh, talk from here. Um, let's do a tell an unbelievable story. We're just gonna talk to each other, deep conversation, um, and tell a data story. So let's go try to do that right there. We get question about the movie plot. Look, that dude's like, I'm in their way. Let me move. <laughs> Good idea. All right, let's do a funny story here. Was that my drink? Oh my goodness, y'all. Hold on a second. I swear people are taking our drinks. Dude, you about to get reset? Hold on. How do you reset? Where is it at? Reset. There you go. And then move this down to her. That is going to be her drink. I don't care what nobody say. Why does it keep... What in the world? Oh, there it go right there. I was about to say, what in the world? Girl, put that in your pocket. That is your drink. Please, go drink that drink. Golly. Like, I hate when that happens. Like, you order a drink and the Sims just be snatching it. Like, dude, you didn't order that drink. I ordered that drink. I ordered that drink. Anyway. All right, we got the self. Yep, we got some skill involved. So let's go potty real quick. I haven't really used the bathroom. He's talking about a funny story about a banana peel. Um, we need to have two deep conversations. So go use the bathroom. Actually, does she use it too? Did she get a chance? She didn't get a chance either. I guess when I cue them up, he's like, I gotta go to the bathroom. Can you go do that, please? 
<laughs> Can you go do that for me, please, darling? Okay, yeah, go use the bathroom. All right, he's going to go use the bathroom. And I guess while she... Whoa! Okay, y'all, did I order it more than once? Or is it somebody else's? Okay, okay, that was hers. All right, I was about to say, did I order it more than once? I hate when they do that, though, because I just feel like... I ordered it. They took the money out of my account and everything. So why are you taking my stuff? Catherine, get your drink, girl. Never leave your drink at the bar. There you go. All right. So go. Okay. I know. I queued you up to go use the bathroom, darling. Go use the bathroom. She's like, let me finish this drink real quick. All right. And then when she comes back, we'll have them sit and chat for a little bit longer. Uh, thankfully, there's like some activity up in here so we might just sit there and try to learn how to do um the i forget the name of this dance the little native dance that's in this area that'd be kind of cute for us to learn how to do that uh what is this use okay but so she's drinking and using it at the same time <laughs> what are you doing oh wash hands okay come sit over here please come sit over here so you can go talk to your wife thank you very much thank you very much all right and hopefully when she comes out what is wrong with y'all we're not gonna pay attention to the kids at the house and then when she comes she'll go sit right there and then they can finish please don't sit in my spot seriously all right so she can sit right here then all right um she'll sit right there all right so while we're here i'll go in and sit here and talk to paulina let me do a friendly introduction maybe we could talk about some places around here that we can go explore possibly um all right and then let's have him going and queued up so we could talk to our wife let's tell her a funny story again we need to flirt with her so let's do that as well um Barbie kiss romance cut with her parents and then hopefully they don't get like an awkwardness from this flirt a bit and then let's go and queue them up to do another conversation Perfect. All right, because we want to make sure we get a gold date so we can have that aspiration taken care of. Oh, look, he's thinking about the drink. Are we going to get sloshed tonight? I feel like we should. I feel like we should get sloshed tonight. This, this is one I wish that they, we had waiters because I could just order. We got to go back up to the bar and order a drink and hope that nobody takes the drink from us. All right, so we also need to kiss our date. We're having another deep conversation, hopefully. Flirt a little bit more. All right, cool. And then we got to go kiss her. Oh, let's kiss her real quick. And then we'll come up here and get something else to drink. Oh, this lady over here making all sorts of mistakes. All right, so then, okay, we got our gold date. Perfect. All right, so can we order? I thought we could order drinks from the group for the group. Uh, I guess we have to do it from here. Well, let me see real quick. I can't order drinks from the order drink. All right, I guess we'll just. Wait, huh? Why can't I order a drink for myself? Practice make it order drink. Okay, there we go. Order drink. I'm gonna say order drinks for the group. There we go. And then we'll get some more margaritas. Alright, so Oh, this is over here talking. I love it. Oh, she's talking about her writing and stuff. Because you know she has a career as a critic. Say, well, give me and my wife around. We're trying to get sloshed. Okay, so I do have base metal in my game. I need to update it though, but we will have a little bit of interactions from Oh, from Lovable. From warmed by a kiss. What else we got? And then of course we got smooth simping. That's gonna make us a little bit tipsy. So as soon as she makes our drinks, why don't you come over here, Harrison, and wait on it? Cause I don't want nobody to take our drink. I paid forty dollars for it. I swear, if one of y'all take my drink, it's gonna be on and popping. All right, y'all. I think I got it together. I just want them to get their drinks and people sitting there trying to take their drinks. But look at this. They actually decorated it for Love Day out here too. So they really taking advantage of this uh, special holiday <laughs> that they got going on. But anyway, all right. So I want to dance and do some fun stuff. And apparently, oh, there's a speaker. I'm like, apparently there's a speaker in here, but I didn't know what we were trying to do. So let's try to sit there and see if we can dance. How do you, how do you, oh, we can't dance? Uh oh, we have last exception. All right, no worries. All right, so they're going to sit there and talk for a little bit. So let me let... Harrison, since we're right here, talk with some people for a little bit. Let's do a cheerful introduction. Talk with some of the locals here. Do a cheerful introduction here. And then we want to question them about the Selva. Uh, I think it's... Oh, wait. I guess he got to introduce himself first. All right. What are you doing over here, darling? I know you're talking to people. She's such a social butterfly, too. So I feel like she just wants to sit over here and just kind of make chit chat local chit chat with the locals i said that completely backwards but you know what i mean <laughs> all right so let's ask about the jungle and then let's do the same thing here yeah, we don't we don't know him yet okay we have to introduce ourselves all right and then she is up here so let's ask about the jungle okay we still don't know this guy you having a whole conversation with this dude about baseball but yet you haven't introduced yourself to him yet enchanting no not enchanting not enchanting oh my gosh not enchanting don't enchant him wow i messed that up y'all do a, oh discuss local heritage okay now we know them all right um get to know a little bit and then we'll do the same thing do a cheerful introduction there oh all right so how do we get i think i need to 
But what is the speaker on or no? Oh, there it is. I'm like, I want to dance. All right, let's dance together. We'll get that together. And yeah, this has been a nice little event out for our first little night uh, in the jungle. But I want to see real quick before. Oh, shoot. I should have came over here before um, they closed up. So I think when we got here, they gave us. Let's see what they gave us. Because we're not going to be able to explore to tomorrow. So they gave us a machete. And we also got, I think, bug spray. Yeah, I think that's it, y'all. So let me see. Might have to come out here and buy some stuff. So let's go over here and get some liquid rush purchase and then get some grilled cheese get that grilled cheese let's get another liquid rush and then let me get the kids i'll get elsie one of these and then we'll get um colin something else when it's time when does colin age up by the way i feel like these kids should be aging up fairly soon wow okay i got it along right now y'all so it's just it's it is what it is um can you please care for yourself and you care for yourself and grandma can you take care of the kids can you socialize with elsie maybe and dad can you build can you build a skill what kind of skill could he build um maybe he went bowling he went bowling for a little bit all right so hunter's gonna come out here i mean harrison lord i'm saying the wrong people gonna come out here and buy this stuff we do need to get ready to wrap it up and get home though so he could um at least get some sleep wait did i pick a doll which doll are we getting did i get this one i got the blue one just shoot i should have paid attention to the the colors let's go in and man forty dollars y'all let's go in and grab those two as well so we can have more all right we're just gonna buy that whole table out i should have seen if he had let's see if he has anything else in here oh i should have haggled y'all um ask about new stock let's see if he has anything else going on run for bajinka like emilio my dude do you have anything else uh purchase archaeology table buy exploration supplies uh i think if i do let's see let's see what says uh thank you for the oh, oh, oh. did you Richard. say anything else i don't see if you don't see what you want to check all right okay all right all right let's see what he has in his body <laughs> to get we got a roadmap to love love wait okay these are all things for exploration because some of these don't look like exploration type stuff should we get a tent or should we just come back home um i think we'll just i think we'll just come back home yeah, we'll just come back home because I don't want to buy a tent. I feel like it's going to be a waste of money. All right, let's go check on the missus real quick. What is she in here doing? Oh, she's just sitting here talking to people. Y'all, this reminds me of last time we went out with her and she was just talking with everybody. She was like enjoying herself so, so much. It was so funny. Oh, look at all these free drinks. Who are these drinks for? Let me go drink that up. Uh, maybe they were like, drinks on us. Drinks on everybody. Go drink that up too, girlfriend. Go grab. Wait, is that water? That might be water. I don't know what this is, but that looks like some gin and tonic, some type of. Oh yeah, they just serving up drinks, y'all. Rum and coke. What's this? What is this one? Oh, we got two bartenders now. Hello. Well, okay. Well, if nobody want to drink this rum and coke, girl, we'll get that too. We about to, like I said, we about to get sloshed, y'all. They're gonna be hung over in the morning. So he's tipsy right now. Nicely decorated. Hanging with the bros, y'all. She is enjoying herself, and of course she is. Oh, she's sobering up. Okay. Oh, the music must have been horrible. She was just like, I don't like this music. All right, and then no, no, no. You're not going home, Harrison. Oh, did she get wet from being outside? What is this though? A horchata. What's this? Okay, go drink that up. We still in people. Oh shoot. Okay, he got a coffee. I'm like, we still in people's drink show. <laughs> oh, is this a vampire, dude? Seriously? Why are all the vampires like um? bartenders it's ridiculous again my game file what is this one she drinking rum and coke and i don't know what this is y'all it's not coming up i want to say it's like water oh i want to learn how to do y'all what is it that's making me get these little mcc exception errors and look he's like in her body i hate when they do that i swear all right let's go um have a definite couple little conversations i guess you could say y'all i am like slow it's like my words today are just like all over the place um i'm a little bit tired to be honest with you guys but had a very a very long day what are you talking about grilled cheese for it's like all my sims want to talk about grilled cheese all right let's tell a dirty joke because you know they've been having like a little liquor in them for a little bit y'all it's already 12 o'clock okay we need to get home because i want them to be able to get a good amount of sleep before they go to the jungle tomorrow so she's feeling confident as soon as they finish with these drinks we're going to head back to the cabana um and get some sleep and are they hungry Ooh, they're a little hungry so we might have to make some food when we get home so can we take this with us is this a hunter can't, i'm not hunter wow why would we keep calling him harrison yeah i know she's like why don't we just want to go back home and get something to eat and go hang out for a little bit all right so let me go on and queue them up to go home and i'll see you guys when we get there 
All right, guys, we're just going to sit here and grill up a couple of little shish kebabs before we go to bed. Ooh, I like shish kebabs in real life, y'all. They, ooh. All right, Harrison, I see you. I see you. And the missus is going to sit here. And, oh, she's thinking about paragliding. I wish we had paragliding and stuff like that here, but, or just in general in the game. That'd be, I'm probably asking for way too much. Anyway, let's do a little bit of get to know, tell an engaging story. Oh, gosh, y'all, I swear. Ah, the game, the game, the game. Anyway, so she's going to sit there and talk to him while he's grilling up stuff. That's like a weird way for you to sit, though, darling. I love how they put the lights and stuff out here, though, y'all. That was so sweet. It's like clearly like a romantic type scenery. I love that. I didn't know they were going to do that, though. That was really nice of them. They were like, we know you guys are celebrating. You know what's funny? I was actually thinking that in the middle of them traveling at home. I was like, did we even formally have like... You could have put that right there. We could have sat out here by the fire. Um, let's see if I can get us to go. Oh, where's he going to put it at? Let me see where he's going to put it at first. Because I wanted to sit outside. I want to sit outside. Where are you? Really, dude? Seriously? Oh, my gosh. All right. Let me see if I can drag these back outside. Because that didn't make no sense for you to come bring it in here. There's like a buffet table right there. Wow, Harrison. Right here. You could put it right here, dude. All right. So let's come over here and... Um, grab a serving and then come sit right here so we can eat in front of the fireplace and then i'm gonna have him do the same thing grab a servant and come sit here and grab something to eat and then we'll go and get in the bed here in a second and start our day off fresh tomorrow i said for you to grab a serve <laughs> that didn't make no sense y'all he is so wait okay so are they really sitting to get back up can you sit here though you got the wow i have no idea because they're still queued up to come sit out here so it's like what why would y'all go? Okay, all right. Well, she scooted over over there. Can you come sit over here? All right, then y'all can sit here and enjoy. Y'all, this is so cute. I love it. If this isn't goals. Oh, I know, Harrison. Just eat, sweetheart. Just eat. Because, I mean, this is like the first little night in the jungle, right? And it's finally clear. Like, it's not rainy and it's, it's, it's kind of starry night. Like, kind of, you know, kind of like sets the tone. You know what I mean? So, anyway. Um... All right, let's see what else we could do before we got to get in the bed. So have them talk a little bit, I guess. Oh, they're talking on their own. I love that they put the lights on the outside, y'all. Let's see, is it cloudy up there? It is a little cloudy. But it'll, it'll be clear tomorrow, y'all. But look at this. Look at this scenery. I'm loving it. Oh, is she about to fall asleep? Girlfriend, don't fall asleep. All right, so let me see. If she's done. Oh, I thought she was done. I'm about to say, whoever gets done first, they can put these away. Uh, go put that away. Do we need to take showers? Oh, we probably do. Um, I'm going to have her actually take a bath with soaks. Let's do some rose petals. Let's make it like he did that for her. And then I'm just going to have him take like a regular shower because, you know, he's a guy. We don't Guys don't care about rose petals inside of a tub. Who cares about that mess? <laughs> I don't know of any guy that cares about that mess. Anyway, who's going to put the food? Oh, maybe I should just put the food up for them. I'll just do it for him because really it doesn't make any sense to be like making it all formal like that i just throw it in the refrigerator form i wonder if when you hear does the refrigerator connect to okay no it doesn't all right but i said that'd be crazy if the refrigerator connected back to what we had at the house oh and before i finish let me split up some of this stuff that we got and put some in her pocket and we're gonna probably have to go back and get some more supplies tomorrow because we're gonna need some um more repellent more repellent and stuff like that okay so we got two and then we should have one of these for her all right cool all right, so she's going to go take a bath with some rose petals. And he's taking a quick little shower. You know what, y'all? This is actually a really good idea for them to have multi, uh, two different ways to bathe. Because she could just relax. And then he could be taking a shower. So sweet. I wish they could have taken a bath together, though. That would be cute. That would be really cute. All right, so is he... Uh, what does he have to do before he goes... Oh, use the bathroom. And then I'm going to cue him up to go on and go to sleep. And Miss Catherine, she's going to have to use the bathroom, too. So when she finishes with that, I'm going to have her use the bathroom. Oh, my gosh. I can make her take a pregnancy test. I didn't even think about that. Uh, and then go to sleep. Hopefully, she doesn't. Oh. Girl, did you fall in the tub? Yeah, it was almost like she fell in the tub for a split second. Aw. I love it. I love it. There you go, girlfriend. All right. And he's taking a really long shower. I like this bathroom, y'all. This bathroom is so cute. I love it. It came out really cute. All right. I know. No, no, no. Don't go to bed yet because you're just going to wake up in the middle of the night. Just wait for the wife. Here, wash your hands. Do that. Go wash your hands. Go do that. I know. I know. Just wait on her. She's coming out in a second. There she is. And go use the bathroom. Wow. All right, guys. I'm going to go on in. Wait, Catherine, darling. 
Oh, she's going to wait. Oh, because we were washing hands in here. Okay. I'm going to say, why are you coming way out here to wash your hands? Uh, do we need to empty this or can we just, okay, I guess we'll just leave it there. And if we want some more popcorn tomorrow, but, um, yep. Yeah, so our next episode, we'll be back with the Harrison and Catherine vacation, I guess, vacation, so to speak. Hopefully we'll be able to get out to the jungle and actually experience some stuff because it'd be kind of sad if we can't, but anyway, so hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you think comment box down below and I will see you guys next time. Bye. You're so funny. So Bye. we went to school, so we can scream outside and run outside. Okay, do you want to tell everybody bye before you start telling me about Bye.